Heads of state from almost 200 countries have been invited to attend this year's Food and Agriculture Organization's World Summit on Food Security. Monsignor Renato Volanti is the Holy See's eyes and ears at the summit. The Holy See is interested to know what is going on in FAO, in WFP, in IFAD, and I have the impression that also the organization, they are interested to hear uh, what the Holy See has to say under a spiritual point of view. Monsignor Volanti is a permanent observer to the FAO at the Vatican, a title he's held for seven years. Seven years in which he's seen world hunger grow to historic level. It is going worse in absolute numbers. So for the first time we have more than one billion people suffering for hunger in the world. According to the UN agency, every six seconds a child dies of hunger. To feed the hungry, it is in the gospel, no? It is one of the teaching of the gospel to everybody who wants to follow uh, uh, Jesus Christ. Monsignor Volanti is at the summit to present the Catholic Church's point of view on the critical problem, since he says missionaries are often the best sources of information. Monsignor Volanti points out the economic crisis, coupled with the lack of transportation and investment in the agriculture sector, are some of the biggest obstacles. For instance, in Africa, just 4% of the available water is used because there are no channels, there is no uh, ways to transport the water in all uh, the sectors, in all the areas in which the water is needed. FAO estimates food production will have to increase by 70 percent and developing countries will have to invest billions to eradicate hunger by the year 2050, an ambitious goal that is at the core of the summit but one that will take action on the part of developing countries to be reached.